we're going to read out a light socket. We're just checking this light socket and lamp to make sure and verify it's wired properly. Here's our plug. Okay, on your lamp socket, the center metal in there, the metal that looks brass or copper, that's your center contact, that's your hot contact. The threads of the socket are your neutral or ground. And we're going to verify that this lamp is wired properly. We have a multimeter. We're going to select the ohms position. Verify your meter leads are the right jack. That says ohms. Red goes to ohms. Black goes to common. Verify our meters are plugged in right. And we have ohms selected on our meter. Okay, now we're going to take our lamp plug. You see there's one probe is real thin. And the other probe is a little bit larger on your plug. The smaller probe, if your plug is wired properly, is the hot side of your plug. That's where voltage comes in. The bigger probe is the neutral or ground of your light socket. We're going to take and verify we have a good ground contact. Grab our meter. It will read 0.3 ohms. So we have a good connection there. We have good contact. Here you also might want to touch the center probe to verify you have a dead open. And there we have good contact. We have a good open. And that side of the plug is hooked up properly. Ground side is going to the ground side of our socket. Now we're going to go to the smaller probe on our plug. That should be the hot side. This should be connected to this center contact of our socket. Okay. There's our meter. Reading open. We're going to go to the center Contact on this socket is the copper colored metal. And we're going to check for continuity. Now if you have open here and you don't have any continuity, your switch might be in the off position. So you might want to click your switch. But we have good contact there. This socket is wired properly to the plug. So we verified that's all good. Also, you might want to touch the ground threads to make sure you have a dead open while you're doing that test. Make sure your hot wire isn't shorted to the ground contact of the socket. Okay, now we're just going to take and hook it up. Put our probe on the hot side of the plug and touch anything that's metal all over your lamp body. Just to make sure that you don't have a short to anything metal that's going to cause you to get shocked and it's all reading open that's checking out your lamp make sure it's wired right hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching